y'all. How y'all doing out there? Thank you for tuning in to my channel. My name is Nisi. This is my little corner of YouTube and you're watching Simply Nisi. We love everything over here. Handbags, fashion, hair, makeup, family, fun, and faith. If any of these things are something that you definitely enjoy, then keep on watching. We keep it real, raw, and uncut over here, and we definitely do not do drama. I love to have you here to be a part of the family. If you like what you see, consider clicking the subscribe button down on the right-hand corner of your screen. Turn those notifications on so you're in the VIP for when these videos drop. VIP section. Hey, family, how y'all doing out there? I am so glad you guys are back. I am so glad that you guys rock. I know I mentioned um, if you follow me on Instagram that my video was going to be a little late today. Um, yesterday was just a really, really day, uh, fatigue day for me, and I just <laughs> It's been a busy weekend, I'll just say that. And uh, But I was definitely waiting on an item that I wanted to share with you all. And now that I have it in my possession, which I got it on yesterday, I can truly, truly show you um, what it is that I have for you today. So your video today um, will be about 4 p.m. Central Standard Time, which is this video. We'll be back on schedule for Wednesday's video and on Friday. So nonetheless, nevertheless, and with the weight and the blab, and the ranting over <laughs> I want to show you what I acquired from Amazon so this is something that I've been looking at for quite a while and I know a few of us in the handbag community have clear PVC bags um, with the standards um, prior to COVID where we were needing to take into stadiums and concerts and at a lot of other movies some places a lot of a lot of um, entertainment venues that, um, if that's the correct word to use, that our bags had to be clear. And in the beginning, they just sold those cheap, clear plastic with the, oh, uh, I don't even know what strap was, but you get them from Walmart or Kmart or Target or whatever. And those bags had zero style. I know I had a job at one point that had that particular cheap bag and we weren't supposed to carry a lot in there anyway. But because of COVID and because of fashion and because somebody is totally amazing we don't have to worry about that anymore now we can carry our clear items in class in style and with your own swag and twist i noticed um charm by carmen's video where she received uh or she acquired sorry she acquired two um of the clear pvc bags that were super cute with um i don't know if it was canvas the canvas pouch on the inside or what but they were clear with pink trim and one with black trim from tj maxx that was on sale for 18 dollars. i have not made it to my tj maxx and it's literally in my backyard like i can walk across the street to tj maxx um so that might be something i can do today with my walk with lola but i definitely wanted to pick up something um that screams Nisi, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so my bag came from Amazon and it came packaged, in, of course, in the big Amazon pouch, um, uh, manila envelope, and it came packaged like so. I was so, so excited. Now, let me tell you right now, I have already unboxed this item. I have already pulled the stuffing out. So I'm just giving you a re reenactment of how it came to me, if that makes sense. Ziploc baggie. It is made in China. Um, it is a small see-through bag in blue, which um, is iridescent. In some instances, in low light, it's blue, and in high light, it's a bright, bright blue. And in not so steady light, it shifts from blue to purple. So I thought it was pretty cool. Had a cool little dust bag that came with it. And here she is. Y'all know how I feel about pearls. Y'all already know how I feel about pearls. So when I saw this, I had to have this bag. Listen, she is so cute. She is very, very small, very, very dainty. She fits in the palm of my hand. Um, if you're looking for something super cute for a little girl, this is definitely it. Um, if you're looking for something for you, for a minimal carry, this is definitely it. And if you want to pick up something um, while you're, you know, for your entertainment, you know, or even to showcase your statement pieces, this is it. Now, listen, 
don't think that just because you see this pearl handle that it is just a top handle carry. No, 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 baby. She came. She came with a crossbody chain, y'all. And this chain is heavy. Heavy. I might even try to wear this chain as a belt, child, because this chain is something serious. Very, very weighty. Very, very heavy. It attaches on the inside, but I'll get to that in just a second. There is a turn lock closure, which is, of course, reminiscent of the classic Chanel brand. Um, that little stitch there. I mean, I, when I tell you what I paid for this, y'all are going to be like, wow, I can't, you really got to steal. You're going to open up the flap, and it's just, it's simple. It is so simple. And in some ways, you can probably can see some of that purple iridescent. I think I just saw some of it a little bit. But the tabs, there are no sharp corners on this bag. The tabs are secure with these little gold-plated items here. Um, there are some loose strings, of course, that you're going to have to cut. Again, this is an Amazon bag. I mean, what do you expect? You know, there's going to be some, some, you know, it's not top-notch quality. Um, what else? This trim, it's got to be plastic of some sort because it's definitely not leather trim here. Um, there's the purple. Y'all see it? Yes, honey. Yes. <laughs> the whole, everywhere where this bag is blue, it does that. It will do that. And I love everything about it. I love it. Um, and I'll leave the link down in the description box for you guys. Um, it's not wide at all. It will give just a little. If you can see the puckering here, it will give just a little, but not too much. This is definitely not something that you should overstuff. Just carry exactly what you need for the time that you're going to need it and, and keep moving about your day. Two, add that chain. You're going to, these little spots right here, they have these little clips on them, you see? And what you're gonna do is, you're just gonna push it down like so and add your chain to it. You can drape the chain on the outside. Um, you can take it off and remove it and keep the, you know, however you want to do this, you can. You can. Um, I'll do a quick mod shot for y'all. Um, forgive my look today. It is still a little early and um, I have to get breakfast going and I do have a couple more videos to cover. So please, please, please forgive me if you don't mind. <laughs> um, Cause this fatigue is so, so real. And um, I'll get a video up about that, why I feel this way and why it seems like every single video I'm talking about how tired I am. I promise I'll get that to you guys very, very soon. But um, this is her with the chain on like so. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring this bag down, just to bring my camera down, so you guys can possibly see that she can be a top handle carry. So you can see how long this chain is. This chain is a very, very good length. Very good length. You can, oh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be tight to carry it um, at the wrist, but it can be done if you have small wrists like mine, but I would prefer to carry it this way top handle. Um, the ever long strain can be, a uh, chain can be carried as a shoulder bag and it sits right at the hip for me, right below the hip for me. This is the hip. I am five foot four for reference purposes. Let me bring this down for you guys. Sits right there. Or, let's talk about this beautiful crossbody. And it sits perfect. This handle does not go down, it does not slide in, it stays up just like so. Um, it gives the bag a cute little piece of character if you add, ask me. And like again, one more time, y'all know how I feel about pearls. So this is what I have, I also have um, some items here so you all can see exactly what fits inside this bag. 
Um, let me adjust my camera here. You won't be seeing much of my face, but we're definitely going to show you what fits inside this bag. So I have a couple small items just to show you what can, what, you know, size wise, what can and what cannot fit. Um, I have my phone case because I am recording with my phone. So that will fit in here. And that's probably about as wide as it's gonna get for you, a phone case. And I have the iPhone 12, not the 12 Pro or the 12 Pro Max, just the 12. And that case uh, fits in there perfectly. I'm not sure because it's plastic. The reason I just had, had to give a little, push a little, but it fit. My Louis Vuitton Emprunt wallet, it fits straight down in there like so. And I have my Fenty Glow um, lip gloss slide right in there. There's not much, oh, and I have my keys. And I think my keys are probably going to be pushing it because of the AirPods on them. So let's take the AirPods off and just put my keys in there. And it fits. Now, if I wanted to, I probably could have got those AirPods down the side. Let's try that. We're not gonna do the AirPods. We are going to use hand sanitizer because of the current state of our <laughs> our nation, our community, the world, you know, we're gonna put that there. Um, I'm going to lay the Fenty Glow on the top and put my keys in here like so. And it fits. Now you can slide an ink pen in there if you need to. Now remember your phone is already in here, your wallet, your lip gloss, your keys and your sanitizer most staples for most women so this is this is what you get so we're going to take this out and we're going to try a different combination of items so let's try my eyeglasses case for the glasses that i have on they are tiffany i didn't think it would oh it fits oh wow so okay i didn't think that was going to fit but it does. It could possibly be because it's narrow on the bottom. But if I wanted to flip it upside down, it fits that way too. So um, an eyeglass case, depending on the size, will fit. And this is a um, soft case. I also want to see, and, and you see here, you're not gonna get much of anything else in there with that my AirPods and my keys. Okay, another combination of items. Let's try to get my Coach Peel Case. It fits. Even if I want to stand it up, it will fit. So it fits standing up or lying down. Um, we're going to put my hmm, lotion. Let's try this uh, Bath and Body Works um, travel size lotion in there. Put your AirPods in. And let's try the hand sanitizer like so, and the keys. Now, it fits. However, there's gonna be a bit of struggle with this, this Bath and Body Works lotion. So if you can carry a, some lotion or hand cream in a tin or something just a tad bit smaller than this, that would be advisable so that your corners wouldn't scratch up the top of your bag but it works. All right, so let's take this out and try another set of items. Let's try 
our coach daisy wallet and i'm using all these wallets because i want you guys just to get a feel for um the wallets we know the daisy wallet is definitely thicker than the Empromp wallet so the coach daisy wallet does fit when you turn it the vertical way but if you turn it horizontal it'll fit that way too um just depends on what you're carrying i assume um let's do the louis vuitton coin case you'd have to kind of do a back and forth thing with that um i have some tweezers you can slide down in there put your airpods down in there and your hand sanitizer down in there and this and you still got a little room here for your keys and this is what you're looking like effortless how cute right cute cute many many options many options or you could just throw the things that you need in there you don't have to necessarily pouch it all up you can just actually throw what you're going to use inside. Um, I have my Key Australia sunglasses. We already know that they fit, because, but it's gonna be a struggle because it is made out of the same material as this. But we knew it was gonna fit because of the Coach, I mean the Tiffany sunglasses case. Um, so that was gonna be neither here nor there. But if you wanted to take them out and just slide them inside, you could definitely do that. Okay, and one last thing for you guys to see, which we know is not going to fit, is the Never Full Pouch. We already knew this, um, that it wasn't gonna fi uh, fit. And also, oh, I need to get my um, pochette. Hang on one second. Smaller piece to the multi pochette is pretty much the exact same size as this bag. I am not going to squeeze this pouch in there because I know it's not going to fit. Um, so this is what you have, even with the sides pulled out. And there's some puckering when I try to put that inside. Once you get it in there, you probably won't be able to get it out, but you see how it has changed the form of the pochette, I don't like that. So we won't be using that. Now, the chain is detachable on the pochette and you could possibly add a small garnish to this bag with that particular chain, which I think would be super cute to shorten the, sh the chain if you do not want to um, carry the super duper long one. I think it would be an adorable carry, especially for someone just a tad bit younger. So let's check it out. Let's see if this is going to give what it is supposed to give. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna work crossbody first and see how these chains fare out. The beauty of having functional pieces, right? Now you have a small little garnish that hangs like so which is super cute, super cute as a crossbody. Again, I am five foot four, so this is where it hits me. And then you can either take the long chain off or place it inside the bag, so choose. And carry. Child, it just popped out. Okay. And carry. <laughs> carry. You can either carry it by the 
the longer, simply longer chain, or again, another garnish, and carry it as a top handle carry, which I think is super cute as well. So this is what we have, y'all. I'm gonna link this um, find down in the description box so that you guys can check it out. Let me know what you think about these clear PVC bags. This one again is iridescent. It will have uh, pieces of purple. There we go again inside of it. They have black. I'm not sure what the black changes to or if it changes at all. But again, I'll link this one in the description box. I meant I was gonna tell you how much I paid for this. So I think this bag was originally $11.99 and then there was a coupon where you could save like a dollar or so. And then I had a gift card. I paid a dollar and 27 cents for this bag. Can you believe that? Can I have no complaints after a dollar and 27 cents. I mean, what, right? <laughs> All right, y'all. Thank y'all for tuning into my channel. I love y'all so much for rocking with me. If you watched it this far and you are not subscribed, child, go and click the subscribe button. We love to have you as part of the family. We love you. Thank you for rocking with me. I love y'all. And until next time, bye.